Hi, welcome to UHS. My name is Heather Vance and I'm one of the family medicine doctors here at UHS. Today I'm here to talk to you a little bit more about bronchitis, which is a common thing that we see here at UHS, especially in the colder months like fall and winter. Bronchitis is inflammation in your tubes that bring air into the lungs. It's typically caused by an infection, but it can also be caused by uncontrolled asthma, smoking, or other irritants in the airways. Bronchitis will typically present as a cough. Often it can be spasm-like or repetitive. Sometimes there can be mucus production with the cough, and when it is caused by an infection, it can sometimes have a low-grade fever that accompanies it. Sometimes you can also experience shortness of breath or wheezing with your cough. Classically, the cough worsens when you lay flat. It can also worsen in the colder air or when you're trying to exert yourself. The cough can last up to six weeks, but typically you should find some improvement within the first one to three weeks of your symptoms. How do we treat bronchitis? Well, as we discussed earlier, because when bronchitis is caused by an infection, up to 95% of the time it's caused by a virus, antibiotics will do nothing to improve your recovery time. What you do need is rest, plenty of fluids, avoidance of alcohol and tobacco, and essentially just trying to stay home, watch a movie, and try to get a good night's sleep. You can use over-the-counter cough suppressants to help reduce your cough. Some of the more common ones are Delsum or Robitussin. If you find that you still are having a hard time sleeping despite using a cough suppressant, try propping yourself up on a couple pillows and that will typically help. If you find that your throat is becoming irritated from coughing so much, you can use a throat lozenge or a cough drop. Also, ibuprofen or Tylenol can be helpful if you have a low grade fever and sometimes they can help with a rib pain that you might experience from coughing so much. You want to go to the ER if you're having extreme chest pain or if you're having shortness of breath to the point where you're having difficulty speaking in full sentences or difficulty while walking. If you find that your symptoms are not improving in one to three weeks or you feel like you're worsening, call UHS and we can help. Um, we always have nurses who are available during the day to take your phone calls and even after hours if you're looking for advice. If you call during the day and our nurses feel like you might need an appointment, we have virtual visits available and we also have in-person visits. Sometimes bronchitis can lead to a secondary infection like pneumonia where we might need a chest x-ray to help diagnose that. We have that here as well. So if you need help, call UHS. We're here to help.